if you're suffering from a redirect hack of any kind, you absolutely need to watch this video. Diagnosing the damage. A redirect hack can be an awful experience. The difficult part is that it's actually an umbrella term for many different hacks, all of which have one thing in common, redirects. So what happens if a redirect hack gets into your site? Well, your site traffic can be stolen. You can be locked out from your own site. You could get blacklisted by Google and your customers could be redirected to spam sites selling fake products or even adult content. What will this mean for your business? Your SEO rankings will tank, your revenue will go down, your brand and reputation will suffer and your visitors' data can be misused. We're gonna fix this. Let's first figure out which variation of the redirect hack you have. Number one, automatic redirects. This refers to the redirect which happens when someone clicks on your site in Google, visits it directly, or even when you get redirected when you try to log in. Number two, link redirects. This refers to the redirect which happens when someone clicks on a link on your site and gets redirected to a spam page. Mobile only redirects. This refers to the redirect which happens when someone visits your website from a mobile device and gets redirected. The next step is to confirm whether your website is hacked and how bad it is. You can try this manually, which takes time and can be a complex process. So we've added detailed steps in our blog, which is linked in the description below. But if you ask me, Julian, tell me the fastest and most effective Effective way. I'd say, friend, use a high performance security scanner to scan your website. You can use the Malcare scanner for free. I've added the link in the description. It's also really easy to use. Just go to Malcare, sign up, click on the scan button, and boom, it's going to scan every nook and corner of your website. As I said, it's free and detects even the most well hidden malware quickly. Number two, cleaning the hack. It's theoretically possible to clean your website manually, but I don't think that 99.99% people should try this. I'll give you three quick reasons why. First, it's going to take significant time because the hack could be hidden anywhere, which means you have to look at every file, every post, every page, and every link. Secondly, it's really complex to identify and delete the malware. It could be disguised as a harmless looking file or even be hidden in a fake plugin. Thirdly, even if you somehow manage to remove the malware, you still have to fix the vulnerability or backdoor that led to the hack in the first place. Otherwise, the hack will come back. Fixing this vulnerability or backdoor is an entire challenge on its own. But if you're like me and want a quick and effective solution with no chance of a nightmare scenario, the best way to do this is to use Malcare's auto clean feature. I've tried almost all free and paid security plugins in the market and Malcare, hands down, has the most powerful cleaner. And the best part is all you need to do is click the cleanup button and bam, your site is clean in a minute. So I definitely recommend giving this a shot. All right, congratulations on getting rid of that malware. So here's three main things to do next. Number one, install a security plugin with an integrated firewall. If you use Malcare to scan or clean up your site, you're already set. Malcare's firewall automatically gets configured to your site when you run your first scan. Number two, change all passwords and review all user accounts, plugins, and themes. Number three, update everything. WordPress, plugins, themes. Just don't forget to take a backup first. These three steps have a great effect in reducing the chances of such a hack taking over your site again. Okay, if you're still watching and this video has been helpful, drop a comment below. I can help you with any doubts you may have about hacks or keeping your website safe.